Hey, what's going on? It's your boy BC, and I came here to talk some boxing with the thousands of True School Sports subscribers. Now, interesting story, okay? An interesting, interesting story. I this, this is a follow-up video to a video I just recently did about Adonis Stevenson. As many of you may know, uh, Adonis Stevenson's mother is filing a lawsuit against his uh, his ex-girlfriend, who was scheduled to be or was supposed to be his i guess she was his fiance and she was she was going to become his wife i don't know what the whole situation with that is it seems like they were, weren't legally married but she was on the cusp of getting married i don't know the whole situation with that but the articles refer to her as the ex-wife so we will call her the ex-wife even though uh, that, that doesn't seem to be the case anyway adonis stevenson has spoken about this matter himself and uh, he stated that um as you can see by the headline that his wife his ex-wife is a very good manipulator now listen there's many women out there that are great manipulators. I almost feel like it's it's built in the majority of their DNA. You know, a lot of these women are really good at manipulating the man. And uh, just looking at C, uh, looking at CC God from Instagram from afar, she she just strikes me as one of those women that um that will be the manipul manipulative type in a relationship. Now let's read the article and let's come to our own surmise. You guys can read it for yourself. It'll be in the description. But uh, basically, this was what uh, was stated in the article. Now. Apparently, according to this little part right here, shortly after Stevenson entered the hospital in December 2018, so let, let's paint the picture. Adana Stevenson fights Alexander Vosnik. He gets knocked out by Alexander Vosnik in brutal fashion. He goes into a coma. It's early, it's, it's early December 2018. What does his wife do while whilst, uh, Adonis is in a coma? She goes to... Um, she basically goes to be... She goes to, to a judge... And she goes to be appointed as his provisional administrator to his property. So basically what that means is she wanted to have control over his property, his, his I guess, his houses or his condos or things like that. Like that. Um, and then as you can see, it says right there, six months later, a judge actually ordered the management of the box, boxer's assets to be handled by an independent accounting firm. So they wanted somebody that was completely um, bipartisan, unbiased, so that no, no funny business was happening. So... Luckily for Adonis, that happened. Now, Adonis came out, and these are his quotes regarding the matter. We'll highlight them for you guys. All right, so here, here we go. Here's what, here's, what, here's what Adonis Stevens had to say verbatim. He said, I quote, I want to help people who have concussion problems. I realize that they don't have someone to help them. It's easy for people to, who are vulnerable to be tricked. I was vulnerable. I am not fooling myself. I have been vulnerable. I felt betrayed. Simone God, I am not going to lie. I loved her very much, but she abused Let's highlight that word right there. Abused my trust. She is a good manipulator. There are a lot of things she has done. This situation is very hard for me. I thought it was for life and for me with me and her. Whenever, wherever I was, she was there. You know, when you love the person and you know they will never do anything to you, it hurts. It hurts. Really, she hurt me, but I don't want to start throwing insults to the media. I will let the, I will let the legal system settle this. When you have had... A concussion like that you realize that that family is the cornerstone anyone who has problems like that if they get a chance to see their family go for it it's very important when i was with the other uh simo i was blocked i couldn't express myself i can say how i feel now before i was afraid because she put me in doubt but now i am free a free free man i have no one left to tell me what to say i i feel that my, my mother is there for me i feel surrounded by love with my mother and my family mentally this is something that is good for me and that allows me to recover. I recovered a lot. My mom really played a big part in this. I feel better mentally. Um, and then uh, there was a whole thing in, 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 in the letter that Simone wrote. She said that uh, basically that uh, there were issues with the daughter and he spoke about that. Here's what he said. I didn't kick someone out with my daughter. She fled in the night from the condo she had rented without leaving an address. The novel that Simone invented is far from the truth. She, she was not the sweet and caring lover she claims to be i am not, i am not using the means to see that my my daughter adonia as, as i see my four children donna said so there you have it and for those of you that, that don't know the letter i'm not gonna i'm not gonna read the whole letter for you because i'll literally be here for 20 minutes reading the letter but look i'll spare you look everything you see everything you see in bold lettering that's the letter so like if you want to read the whole letter in its entirety the article will be down below but as you can see it's it's, it's, it's a freaking novel but let me just comment by saying this absolute vindication absolute vindication here on true school sports because listen um i made the video and i was just reading between the lines they i didn't i didn't even have these details that she tried to go and get his uh, seize his property 
when he was in a coma, which makes things even worse. Because, like, who does that? Like, could you imagine, right, you're married, your husband just got brutally hurt, you know, you know he's not going to get six-figure checks and uh, his career is, 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 is ended on that night. And the first thing you think about doing is not only ceasing control of his properties, but then now you also want to go withdraw $891,000, you know, allegedly. Uh, absolutely scumbag uh, character traits from CC, uh, Simone God. Um, and I believe Adonis. I, I know Adonis has a checkered past. I know Adonis has done some things in the past that, 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 that no man should be proud of as far as pipping these women out. But the reality is this. The, rea the, rea the reality is this. Um, as, as I stated in my last video, and I'll continue to say in any videos where things like this happen, I, I will continue to warn fighters that are my friends in the fight game against these types of women like Simone God. These women that are, you know, middle 30s, uh, uh, you know, quote unquote independent uh, uh, women, uh, you know, high maintenance in the fashion industry. These are the kind of women that if you're a fighter with money and something to lose, you want to avoid. I don't care how fine they look. I don't care how fat their asses are. I don't care how beautiful and silky their skin looks. I don't care how nice and juicy their lips are. Stay the fuck away from them. And that's, that, that's just me putting it bluntly. Stay away from them. It's, it, it, it's in your best interest. Because, um, you know, if you decide to get married, if you decide to get married, uh, marriage is for you as a fighter. You know, it is, whether you like it or not, marriage is a business decision. Um, it's a business decision that I think fighters need to be very careful about because um, they can be really, you know, taken for a ride and taken to the cleaners. We've seen it in the past with the likes of Robin Gibbons, Gibbons with the likes of Sugar Shane Mosley, and the list goes on and on throughout the history of boxing. So, um... Luckily for him, you know, God, God bless Adonis Stevenson. It's good. It's good to see that he's recovering. It's good to see that, uh, you know, his family seems to have his best interests at heart. But my my biggest takeaway from this is like, you know, a, 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 another reason why I felt the way I felt about Simone God in the first place was this. Okay, now with Simone God, I find I found it very interesting that she went to social media to air out her her her, her dirty laundry. And it's very telling because, you know, you mean to tell me you knew this man for how, however long you knew him, you were with him, you were, you guys are very intimate with each other, obviously. You mean to tell me you couldn't, you couldn't find a mutual friend, a mutual family, family member to, to help you guys get through whatever problems you were getting through? You had to go to social media to, to do, to, to, to air out your dirty laundry? That's very telling because what it tells me is that she, she wanted the attention, she wanted, uh, she was she was more interested in the intention than solving the actual root of the problem, which would, which was whatever the you know whatever the problem was uh, that that led her to do what she did with withdrawing the money, with uh, trying to cease property uh, uh, cease his property while he was in a coma. You know that that's that's some that's that's that that's some scumbag type stuff. So um, I have no sympathy for Simone God. I hope she gets nothing and and, and likes it because uh, that's what she deserves. Straight up and down, with no, no special effects. That's what she deserves. Um, and you know, I'm always listen. For me, I'm, I'm a, I, I have a soft spot for men who get taken to the cleaners because I've had a lot of friends and family and people I've seen them get destroyed by, destroyed by women, and um, I've just seen how the legal system works. And it's 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 always stacked. It's the odds are always stacked against men. They're they're always stacked against men. So, you know, hopefully Adonis doesn't get his life ruined. Um, I'll be praying for the guy. But uh, let 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 this be a learning lesson to any and all athletes out there to really vet these women out because. Uh, they could be the ruination of your life, you know. If you want to get biblical, even the Bible says that uh, uh, a bad wife or a bad woman uh, can be poisonous to your bones. So, but a good woman will be a crown to your head. She'll be, she'll be, she'll be a jewel. And, and a good woman is very hard to find. It even, it even says it in the Bible. So, with that being said, those are my uh, my, my my little thoughts on the whole matter uh, with Donna Stevenson and Simone God. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Do you guys have any uh, change of heart now that we went ahead and kind of heard from Adonis himself. It's not just true school sports and BT speaking. Cause like the last video I did, you had a lot of people saying, well, you can't be judging her. Uh, she stood with him when he was, when he was, the, when he was uh, in the hospital, this, that, and the third. But yeah, she was with him in the hospital, but she made sure at the visitation hours, she made sure to go to, to, to try to seize, pro uh, to seize his property. She made sure to go to the bank, the bank and try to take out $891,000. So listen, it is what it is. Um, they say BTU. Are you being TMZ? I might as well be. I might. I might as well be boxing TMZ because I ain't shit to do here on quarantine. You know, there's nothing going on in boxing, so it's a pretty interesting story. You know.
Any anybody who wants anybody who wants to get the name of the news now is gonna, is gonna get a video about them because we have nothing to do, we have nothing to talk about. But anyway, I digress. You guys, let me know what your co thoughts are in the comments down below. Make sure you take the time to subscribe, and like I say in every single one of these videos, you can love me or you can hate me, but I'm just a kid from being it. So until next time, take care, guys.